Hi, it's Tim from oraclebase.com. In this video, we'll give a demonstration of online statistics gathering for bulk loads. Since 12C, Oracle has been able to gather stats during some bulk load operations. This might save you having to run additional stats gathering steps before starting to process data in ETL operations. We connect to a privileged user, create a test user called TestUser1, and grant it the Create Session and Create Table privileges. We connect to the test user so we can start. We use a create table as select or CTAS to create a table with a thousand rows. This is just dummy data, but it could have been based on a select from an external table. Checking the num rows column in the user tables view shows us some stats have been gathered. There are other table level stats, but for simplicity we'll use the num rows column to show if stats have been gathered. The user tab call statistics view contains column level statistics. Here we've displayed the low and high values for the ID column. The note column tells us these were gathered as part of a load operation. We truncate the table to remove all the segments, then we do a direct path insert using the append hint. This time we load 500 rows. The num rows column in the user tables view now shows 500 rows, showing stats were gathered for the direct path insert against the empty table with no segments. This time we truncate the table to remove the segments, but use a conventional path insert of 700 rows. Notice we don't have the append hint this time. When we check the user tables view, it still has 500 rows recorded from the direct path load. The conventional path insert hasn't triggered the stats gathering during the load. In this example, rather than truncating the table, we delete the rows. The table is empty, but there are existing segments from the previous load. We do a direct path insert of 700 rows. Notice the append hint is back. Once again, the stats were not gathered during the insert. With direct path inserts, the stats are only gathered for tables with no segments. The no gather optimizer statistics hint prevents stats gathering. In this example, we truncate the table and do a direct path insert of 700 rows, but we include the hint. We still see the 500 row value from a previous load. As expected, the hint prevented the stats from being gathered during the insert even though the rest of the conditions were correct. We drop and recreate the test table as a partition table with two partitions. We do a direct path insert of 100 rows into the new table. All the data will go into the 2016 partition. We see the user tables view has the correct global value of 100 rows, but there are no rows recorded at the partition level in the user tab partitions view. We delete the table stats, truncate the table and do a direct path insert into the table, explicitly naming the table partition. This time the user tables view doesn't contain any global stats, but the partition stats are present. We can see only some scenarios trigger the online stats gathering for bulk loads, and there are limitations to what stats are gathered. Even so, this can make the difference between a bad execution plan and a better one. If in doubt, add an extra stats gathering step after large data loads. In 19C, there's a new feature called real-time statistics that fill in some of the gaps. We'll cover that in a separate video. Thanks for watching. As always, there are links to articles containing lots more information about this subject in the description box below.